Hey there, happy Monday. It is eight, uh, August, I was gonna say April, it's definitely not April, it's August 12th. I'm so stoked to do my Monday motivation. You know, I'm coming off of a weekend that just totally filled me and fueled me. It was a weekend where I got to spend a lot of time with my family and uh, have all of my kids together, well, almost all of my kids together, and just really get to spend time with them and connect with them. And this has happened a couple weeks in a row where I've just got some good downtime and actually been at home and just really forgot how much I miss uh, the simple life. And so really what I am, motiv what's motivating me this morning and this week is just gratitude. I had a couple weeks ago uh, an anxiety attack. I guess you'll call that a panic attack, not sure. For years I struggled with a fear of death and it would be, it would cripple me. And I would turn to everything humanly possible to take my mind off of when I was processing death and the fact that this life is temporary and that we don't get to do this life forever. And through my walk and my journey, I realized that the only way to get through that was with God and through prayer. And it was, it was something that I did. And for about 10 years now, probably a little bit longer, I've been able to speak about it. And God has just really given me comfort in this area. And he is obviously the Prince of Peace and, and peace has been delivered. But here recently, that was kind of taken. And I got to tell you, I was in that movie, um, the the something Hollywood, the Quentin Tarantino movie. I'm probably even messing up his name. Not my cup of tea, but obviously an amazing movie to many people. But I was in a theater that had no side on this side. So it was just a solid wall. And it was totally packed, totally packed. And uh, whew, first panic attack in like 10 years hit. And it was just like, whoa, nowhere to go. <laughs> totally closed in and I just went into prayer. That's what I knew would change it. I know that's the game changer now. I know he's who I turn to and uh, you know, and it turned me around and it really just got me thinking about what I'm doing and what I know is I'm never going to regret not building another company as much as I absolutely without a doubt love selling houses. I'm never going to regret a house that I didn't sell. I am definitely going to regret the time that I didn't spend. And so I am so excited and so thankful to God and just to be in a place of renewed vision and purpose and remembering what is important to me and what my win looks like and to be so thankful to get to be part of an industry that will allow me to have a great life while never sacrificing time or with friends or family and my children and so my goal is to just go forth and be filled with gratitude day in and day out, to not have a vision about and a, and a focus of my problems and my struggles, but to just daily be so thankful. Uh, so many people are battling so many things, so many diagnoses, so many illnesses, so many hardships, so many losses. We're living in a society today where so many people are suddenly and tragically losing loved ones. And there's just so much going on that I would encourage and hope that each one of us can just start being filled with total gratitude and excitement to just to get to live simple lives and basic lives. And because in the end, I, I think those are the best things. I don't think that the material items matter. I think it's just about being with who we love and, and getting to make those memories. So I hope that you are pumped, excited, ready to make a difference in your week. And I hope that you are filled with a tremendous amount of gratitude no matter what you're facing no matter what you're battling you're here today and you get to make memories today so I hope that you do that you take advantage of that you seize that and that you really get intentional about living in the living in your um, your gratitude live in that space live in that space in that place and always be fulfilled and have a heightened awareness remembering that you don't even know what you're being shielded from and what you're being protected from so anyways i that was a very impromptu monday motivational thank you for so much for listening to me ramble i am so thankful to get to do all i i get to do and i'm gonna go do it now all right bye guys kill your week